Look at what I brought in, guys. Hello guys, Barrick Forster here, and today, yesterday, I am at a beautiful lake. Look at it, it's so pretty. Beautiful. We're gonna be doing some kayaking, some fishing, and uh, you might be wondering why I have this on my head. Well, I was carrying some rocks and they were quite heavy, so I was like, you know what? I'm gonna go African style and wear them on my head, but I had to have padding, so that's why. So, we're gonna be doing some fishing. I'm here with uh, a couple of friends of mine and my mom. So hopefully we will be able to catch some fish and if not at least have some fun and get some get some good shots. So I will see you when something interesting happens. Oh, it's so nice out. Oi! It's my turn for the kayak. It's my turn for the kayak. Yeah, right now. It's my kayak. If you want a kayak, buy yourself one. Yeah, sure. She stole my kayak. Thinks it's hers. Alright guys, finally, can't really see me, but we finally got out on the water under this really big bridge. It's really cool. It's an old, old bridge. But uh, there might be some fish under it. We're gonna try and just see what happens. I gotta pull out. We'll just see. See if we get anything. Alright guys, right now, we're heading to a different spot. We uh, didn't catch anything over by the river. I mean, not the, not the river, the bridge. But uh, I'm with Troy right now, and he remembers catching a bunch of fish over. There's some docks over in that direction. So we're gonna do some paddling, and hopefully we'll be able to catch some crappie or walleye or something like that. So. So I guess we'll see once we get there. See you when we get there. Yeah. <laughs> 
there used to be an old bridge under under this one, this newer one. So we might be able to, yeah, we might be able to find something. Who knows? Guess we'll see. Those are the docks right over there. Docks that we're gonna try in a bit. Looks like a little houseboat. I'd love to have a little houseboat. Those things are so cool. It's really. Here goes a truck. Oh, it's really pretty out here. Me at least, and I know Troy too. We go. We don't just go fishing just to go fishing. We go fishing to enjoy the beauty. Because, as you saw, it's absolutely beautiful here. It's in the. It's at the end of January, and it's absolutely beautiful. It's like 60 degrees. I was walking around with a sleeveless shirt, and perfectly fine. Really pretty. It's amazing. I, I never understood people who liked flat land. I know a lot of people don't just don't even care for the hills and just like flat land. I never understood that. Never understood that. I can't stand flat land. I'd much rather see pretty pretty hills like this than see a bunch of flat land, just farming equipment. But hey. Different strokes for different folks. Haven't got anything yet. No, we're looking for that fifth. Yeah. There's uh, my mom and Angie. They're they're going to do. There's another fisherman. He's everyone around here is real friendly. Yeah. Hopefully we'll get that the 50 pounder. Here's that dock we are talking about. We're gonna throw a little bit and hopefully we'll be able to get some fish. All right guys, I've been trying to fish with this and having no luck. But Troy. Are you still on? Yeah. Troy gave me this one. I'm gonna see if they'll bite with this one. Troy's been getting some bites. Hopefully I will too. got any nibbles yet but hopefully we'll be able to get something soon but even if we don't I'm just happy we got to go out fishing cuz man it's beautiful here well guys not having much luck today but it's all right. It's still extremely enjoyable. Troy decided he's gonna head out into the middle of the lake and uh, just drift back to uh, our campsite. Might be able to start a fire. We got some matches, so we might have a little campfire or something like that. But for now, I think I'm gonna follow Troy and uh, go into the middle of the lake and just let the wind pull me through. Back to where I was started. I'll throw a pole in and let it troll behind me or something like that. So we'll just have to see what happens. My goodness. That wind is strong. Pushing me backwards.
Look at what I brought in, guys. It's a nice, uh, I think it's a smallmouth bass. It's a nice, good size. Just might keep it to eat later. But I've been fishing around these little twigs and stuff. It's been sticking, sticking out of the land, but that's pretty cool. I'm glad I finally got some. At least we didn't get skunked. Oh, about to run into a branch. Yeah. Probably. Okay guys, so that'll do it for kayaking today. So we might be getting some stuff later on, but for now I didn't catch any more fish, which is too bad. But hey, at least we didn't get skunked. So anyway, we loaded up the kayaks in the truck and we're getting ready to leave, so. At least I didn't get skunked, yes, of course. Yeah. Well, us as a team, we didn't get skunked, though. Yeah. Alright. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Hey guys, Barrack Forrester here, editing Barrack Forrester here, and as I was editing the video that you just saw, I realized that I didn't ever videotape like a goodbye, so here it is, the next day later. Thank you so much for watching this video, um, it, of course it was a lot of fun for me to make because I was fishing, but uh, if you guys would like to see more videos like this, I will make them as I go fishing, if you like them. But anyway guys, thank you so much for watching this video. Subscribe if you haven't. And if you haven't, you should probably subscribe. What else? Oh yeah, comment. Let me know. If you comment, I will most likely comment back. Either me or Devin will comment back. We'll try our best to comment to everybody. But anyway guys, thank you so much for watching this video. Barrack Forrester signing out, and we'll see you on the flip side. Bye-bye.